Tutorial 1 Stage 3 Welcome to Stage 3. In this tutorial we'll be simply looking at logging into the front end and navigating to the admin back end to look at some of the basic features found there. Firstly, using the admin name and password that was created in during the setup, log in to Drake CMS. We will see the user menu once you have completed this. Once the user menu appears, you have one of the options as administration. Click on this. This will bring up the front page of the Drake CMS administration back end. From this point we are able to access all of the user content, the news items, configuration settings for Drake CMS, modules and component setups. System menu, one of the most important areas. Here you can alter your configuration via the global configuration option. From global configuration you are able to reset your website title you are take, able to take the website online and offline and to have an offline message displayed when it is offline. You have the options to change how your registrations are handled by new users. The other, other tabs are things such as you are able to set your local time offset. You are able to choose what editor you are using and some of the things that are displayed in relation to the content items and news. You are able to re-look at your database setup. Um, you are able to see uh, some of your server options such as site compression etc. And as far as uh, extra security goes you are able to implement capture options for the guestbook and login. The system menu also allows you to manage users, subsites, templates, languages, important feature is the database where you are able to form backup and restores, tarball backup and other items under the system menu. Menu simply as allows you to administer the menus that are installed by default, to add to those menus and to even create new ones. Selecting a menu shows you the items that are displayed there where you have full control over that part of the CMS content. This will be the subject of a separate tutorial as it is the main engine for the CMS. Here you control the content, the publishing of items, the publishing of news and much much more. Components and modules are the guts, the core of the CMS. Most of these items have further configuration and setup and will be covered in later tutorials as will the modules and drawbots. So there we have the basic run through on the, of the back end. Return to the front end we can either go through the system menu via preview through new window or current window or simply select the menu item front end. By selecting win a new window it means that the administration window remains open so that you are able to conduct any activities in the back end and immediately we see the results in the front end. Back to the front end. This now ends stage 3.